Okay, this is uh, EC476, and uh, tell me about your project. We, we call it Air Jam. It's a, uh, a wearable air guitar. Uh, yes, you wear this flux sensor that can detect uh, the way your fingers bend. And move your hand around so I can see the flex sensors. So on the back of each finger is a flex sensor. Right. Thumb two. And this is a fretting hand. You, you choose the chord you're playing uh, with, with the flex sensors. Okay. And this is a pick we used. It's an uh, accelerometer. accelerometer, and it can detect the strong emotion. And so, as you, I see, as you're moving it, it's the the synthesizer is right. detecting the strum. Right. Cool. Now, you, in case you're wondering why, because it's that cool. It is. Does there need to be a better reason? There does not have to be a better reason. All right. So let me see you play something here. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, this is the the chorus for Hotel California. <laughs> Very nice. And um, we have 24 chords of the major and minor um, um, chords built from 12 chromatic notes within one one uh, um, one um, uh, octave. Octave, right? <laughs> Sorry, I'm a bit nervous. Um, so I you can you can play a, about guitars. you can play a lot of songs with, with these chords, basically. Mm -hmm. I can pl I can play through the scales. Like, yes, That's why we're having him demo it. Besides the fact that I know nothing about guitars. Oh yeah. That's I see. Awesome. See, that's awesome. All right, now I want to I want to come in on the glove a little bit here and All take right. a look. And flex it down a little bit so I can see the sensors. Yeah, very cool. And now we now we follow the wires back and there's an interface board here which has what on it? Well, the the primary primary things that, we, that are of interest are uh, these voltage dividers because these are variable resistors so the, the, uh, the flex, flex sensors, sensors are variable resistors so we use this as a voltage divider uh, and we have a uh, and these op amps which com which are, are configured as analog comparators to a particular voltage and the for the in for the digits uh, these are 400 kilo ohms because that would what gave us a nice trigger the the thumb doesn't flex quite as much as the other fingers so it's only got a, a 300 kilo ohm uh, voltage divider the other things we have here is, uh, since the output of our uh, Atmel Mega 32 is uh, a pulse width modulator, we have to low pass filter it before we can, you know, output it. So it's a nice clean sine wave. So that's what these are, and this is the output. And this is just a uh, fairly simple um, uh, device for connecting things like speakers and headphones. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, we would have needed an amplifier in order for volume control for the headphones, which is why we're demoing using speakers. And uh, this stuff here. This is because this is the first thing I've ever soldered. I see. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna move back just a little bit, and then I'd like you to do one more short demo um, from this angle. All right. Um, well, I didn't prepare uh, so many songs. Just to Hotel California right. again. Yes. Yeah. 